Republic of Moldova, Ukraine, at the level of Minister of Foreign Affairs and Minister of Defense, and the Ministers of Defense of Romania, the Republic of Moldova, and Ukraine. Fărilor afacerilor externe și ministrilor apărării ai României, Republicii Moldova, Greetings on behalf of my minister Kuleba, who could not come in person. But everything started from Crimea and everything should be resolved in Crimea. The Crimea lesson learned us that the appeasement language Putin takes as weakness. So the suggestion that comes from Ukraine and has been supporting, supported by Romania and Moldova and many other countries that we have to be a bit more decisive when it comes to isolation of Russia, sanctioning of Russia, when it comes to the justice. And the, one of the issues that we discussed today during our, our lunch was the justice issue. You know that Ukraine has been initiating the special tribunal on the crime of aggression, which we believe is a mother of crimes, and without punishing the Russian leadership, we cannot speak about accountability of Russia. We believe that the compensation mechanism should be also performed, while one day I hope that Russian people would be mourning and accepting the reality that Russian leadership supported and shared by Russian people committed the war crimes against Ukrainian people. In terms of defense with both Ukraine, Moldova, and Romania share not only common borders and history, what is even more important, we share a common vision of our foreign policy course to the democratic European family, common European families and values. We also share common threats, such as the Russia hybrid war against Moldova and the full-scale war against Ukraine, which threatens all the Azov Black Sea region states. În acest context regional dramatic, Republica Moldova este alături de Ucraina în rezistența împotriva acestei agresiuni. Reiterăm poziția noastră consecventă privind susținerea suveranității și integrității teritoriale a Ucrainei în hotarele internațional recunoscute. Republica Moldova condamnă ferm războiul neprovocat și nejustificat declanșat de Federația Rusă contra Ucrainei și considerăm că toate crimele de agresiune și atrocitățile comise pe teritoriul Ucrainei trebuie să fie investigate, iar persoanele implicate trebuie să fie trase la răspundere în conformitate cu prevederile dreptului internațional. Ne exprimăm sprijinul pentru formula de pace pe care președintele Zelenski a propus-o și de altfel am și discutat în întâlnirea noastră trilaterală despre modalitățile de a pune în aplicare această formulă de pace.